Hello guys, it's Riles Gaming, and today I'll be making probably one of the most iconic cars from Fast and Furious. Dom Toretto's Charger. Yeah? Alright, so, with Dom Toretto's Charger, I've already got in the black, I've put the V8 in there. Wait, where the hell is it? It'll appear later. Um, now I've got some of the mini parts done. So, let's start with the front. Now, I'm gonna need a good grill. I think that will do. I'm gonna do the one where it's kind of all there. I don't really want to add the part where they have the headlights in. Although I could. I could definitely do that. Actually. Yeah, that's the issue. This is not working. That does not look right. I'd rather have... I have a model out right now, just to have a look at it. We'll go like that, and I'm going to thin it down a little. There, that looks alright for now. Indicators, let's go do that. Alright, we'll do that. Um, that's all indicators, so that should be fine. And there's something at the bottom. I think one of these. Yeah, I'm looking at a uh, model right now, just to get some idea. That needs to be a little bit more down. That's a little bit higher. That looks alright for now. Alright, let's um do some other little stuff. Such as um wipers, we'll do them. Alright, we're done wipers. I wanna just quickly turn that to opaque. And I gonna have to keep looking at what else we can do for the car. I'm trying to find the front hood. That could work. I'm just so confused why I had this even in here. Oh, well. I've done wheels already. I'm just trying to find if I um, can get the uh, top part. I forgot the name already. Oh, well. Now, door handles are pretty simple on the model I have. So, it's just that. So, we'll do them. And we have the fuel cap at the back. I'm going to shrink that down a little. It's like, there. We'll place it there for now. That should uh, look accurate enough. I'm going to try something. Boom. Now, I know alternators aren't going to be it. Oh, this is uh, hard. Please don't lag. There you go. Unless I shrink that down. Turn it 3D. Make it move up. And then we're gonna... This is not gonna... This is DIY stuff you're seeing here. You know what? That kind of works. Can we just make that all metal? Chrome. Not even that. We'll go steel. Like I have here. That's working. So this is uh, pretty good. That's exactly what I need. Yep, I found it. Give it a little shrink. This is a weird way of doing it, but... Bam, steel. Uh, I'm gonna mirror that. I'm gonna... Pop that out a little. I'm gonna grab another one. I, I, that's actually working out pretty good. And to be honest, I didn't think it would. No, I don't like that one. Voila. I'm just gonna... Not do what I just did. This might be the hardest project I've done. I'm working on this, alright? How hard is it? I just need a scoopy thingy. Scoopy thing, that's exactly all I know. Oh, this might work. Now we'll go scale. I think that looks sick. It just doesn't have the front beef. That is probably the closest I've got. Is it a bit too forwards? Uh, I guess we're going to have to move it a little. I want to move it up a little, so that's exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> this looks very goofy, but it's going to have to do. Bam! That is like your engine. 
It doesn't look right on the sides yet, so we're going to have to keep working on it. That is going to have to do. I'm dying <laughs> from how long it's taken. Uh, Moulding, I might do. That looks pretty decent, but that's going to have to do for that part. Now, we're on to what? I'm looking at indicators. Now, the back is going to be a bit of a pain. Hopefully not that bad, but we'll see. Um, yeah, with the back, that's... Does that work? Now, uh... <laughs> Why? I want to turn that red. Bam! Yeah, that's going to be reverse light. Brake light, so... We'll turn off that, and we'll go brakes. Tail lights, I have nothing. If I turn the brightness up a little bit, that should, uh... No! Alright. Reverse light should be fine. Indicators look alright. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Alright, so that's pretty close in my opinion. And what was the plate? It was like California. There you go. Bam! Alright, now, uh, what else am I doing? Lighty ball. Or whatever you call it. Reflector. That is what it is. Scale. We'll just shrink that down a little. Alrighty, so that's... Looking pretty accurate to the point that I have, but let's say I want to add a little bit more detail Now it won't be exactly accurate, but it's got that little car bit so I might turn that as tail light just For a little bit of um detail and that's supposed to be the color of the car Now that doesn't look exactly right And if I go nothing you've just got holes of nothing I'm going to have to make it slightly smaller, slightly thinner. That hopefully will look accurate-ish. Now, exhaust-wise, I need these. Mirror those. Oh, it's a bit more out, though. I'm going to have to 3D them again. There! Ta-da! No, do not turn them. They're more in place, so there. I think that looks pretty good. Now, I will have to export it into BMG. I'm going to test a little bit of stuff. If I can do the most impossible thing and probably most inaccurate car thing to do is that weird wheelie that thing. I want to add the little dodge badge, but that's not going to be able to happen. So, uh, I'll do all this stuff and I'll be back in BMG. Alright, for the ultimate test, uh, or one of the tests we are doing, I'll be testing the quarter mile strip race. Uh, drag race pretty much so let's find an opponent vehicle to race <laughs> Later. 